the issue that put me in this race is frankly Pat Toomey. Sean Gale voted twice for outgoing Republican Senator Pat Toomey, but says he's disappointed in some of his votes, motivating Gale to run for his seat. Pat Toomey, who's supposed to be a Republican on our side, who votes against funding the border wall, who votes to convict President Trump. Gale has been traveling the state, often with his brother Joe, meeting voters in their living rooms. We're literally in houses every single day, multiple times a day. In small groups or on a debate stage, Gale says he'll uphold conservative values. They wanted to fund the police. So this is not the time to be stripping law-abiding citizens of their right to bear arms. He blames Republicans as well as Democrats for inflation, including some of the highest gas prices in the nation. Tom Corbett, a Republican, our last Republican, along with a Republican majority in the State House and State Senate, they gave us the highest gas tax in the nation, 58 cents per gallon tax at the pump. And what did it give us also? Tom Wolf. Gale is calling for election reform and a repeal of Act 77, which allows for mail-in voting. Do you accept that Joe Biden's president? I think what I do accept is that we have operating elections here, right here in Pennsylvania, under unconstitutional election laws. And that's Act 77. It's probably the biggest scandal in Pennsylvania history, and they're doing a great job of sweeping it under the rug. Republicans voted for it. I'd say you're absolutely right. And as I've made clear, I am not a fan of the Republicans that we have both in Washington and in Harrisburg. Gale says he's sowing the seeds for what he hopes will be a bright future in politics. Barbara Barr, WGAL News 8.